Welcome, this video will be a full guide on how to pair your Apple Watch SE3 with your iPhone. So basically what you have to do is unlock your iPhone first and bring your watch closer to the iPhone. Make sure that your Apple Watch is showing this screen. If you don't see this uh, on your Apple Watch screen, that probably means that it's discharged and you should uh, charge it for a while before continuing this process. Now, unlock your phone and you will receive a notification like this. In order to set up your Apple Watch, you just have to click continue but if you don't see this notification, and that's not a problem at all, you just uh, have to go to the app library on your iPhone and search for the watch app. Open it and then tap stop pair start pairing. Uh, then choose who you want to set up this watch for. I'm gonna set it up for myself, so I'm gonna go with the first option. Next, scan the watches watch face with your iPhone's camera, keep it steady like this until your Apple Watch is paired. Okay, now you can uh, decide whether to restore uh, the data for your Apple Watch from the backup or set it up as a new Apple Watch. I'm gonna choose set up as a new Apple Watch in order to show you all the uh, steps you have to take in order to set up your device. So. Uh, Next, click, uh, select the wrist preference, so select the wrist you want to wear your Apple Watch on and then tap continue to proceed. Then read, read the terms and conditions and tap agree. If you want to add a, a, a passcode, you have to tap create a passcode and then uh, enter the passcode on your Apple Watch's uh, display. Then confirm it, and uh, then you're, you're gonna go to the next step. But for now, I'm uh, not gonna create any passcode. Uh, you can always do this later in settings. So I'm gonna go with the third option don't add passcode. And then confirm. Now adjust the text size by moving this slider to the left to in decrease the text size and to the right to increase it. And also, if you want to, you can make the text bold by switching this toggle. And you can see the result right on your uh, Apple Watch's screen. Then tap continue. Once you're happy with the result, click OK. Then provide the data about your uh, health. So your date of birth, you just select this option and uh, change it to the value that is right for you. Then you can uh, set the uh, sex for yourself then tap continue. Once you're ready, you can always return back by tapping the back icon in the top left corner of the screen. So provide your ha uh, height, weight, uh, and if you are a person moving by a wheelchair, then uh, switch this toggle to the right. Okay, so right now let's tap continue, then continue once again, and then you have to choose how you want to control Apple Watch uh, gestures. You can choose between wrist flick and double tap and you can show what it looks like on uh, in this animation. So just choose what's uh, right for you and tap continue to proceed. Then you're gonna have to wa wait until your Apple Watch is synced with your iPhone. So now let's wait. And once the synchronization process is finished, you are free to start using your brand new Apple Watch. Just tap done, then skip on your Apple Watch and now it's uh, finished. Thank you for watching this video, I hope that it helped you and if it did please consider subscribing to our channel, leave us a like in the comment below and I'll see you in the next one.